Hi, I'm Karen Hansen with Viking Life Saving Equipment, and I'm here today to introduce you to the Rescue Coastal. The Rescue Coastal is our nearshore life raft. It's for rescue within 24 hours. The raft is ISO 9650-2 certified. The Viking Rescue Coastal far exceeds ISO 2 requirements. One example of this is the self-erecting canopy which inflates upon inflation of the life raft. The life raft also is built to solar standards, which means that each buoyancy tube will support the weight of the people in the life raft independently. If you should put a hole in the upper tube of the life raft, the lower tube will support their weight and vice versa. The life raft is equipped with a rigid boarding ramp as well as grab handles to assist you in a quick and easy evacuation from the water. The first person in would release the ladder, throw it overboard to assist other crew members into the life raft. The self-erecting bright fluorescent yellow canopy can be seen at great distances. It also has solace grade retroreflective tape on the canopy, the tubes, and the bottom of the life raft. The Rescue Coastal has a single large canopy opening for easy access from the boat or the water. In addition to the single opening, it also has a viewport in the back which gives you a 360 degree view of the horizon. The large opening in the front of the life raft allows you to be helicopter hoisted from within without making you have to get out of the raft and go in the water. You are able to zip the canopy opening up with the easy slide zippers, creating additional freeboard and yet still having cross flow ventilation into the life raft. The life raft has an external lifeline around the exterior rim of the life raft as well as an internal lifeline to keep you secure in heavy seas. The Rescue Coastal has two U.S. Coast Guard Solus lights. It has an interior light that's a constant light and an exterior light that's a strobe light that flashes SOS. Both lights come on when the life raft is deployed and the canopy inflates. As the canopy goes up, the pin pulls out of the light and the light comes on. If it's daytime use and you wish to conserve power, simply place the pin hanging next to the light into the slot behind it and save your power to be used at nighttime. It has pressure relief valves in the upper and lower tubes to expel the excess air from the CO2 inflation. The pressure relief valves maintain a constant working pressure on both tubes. Beneath the life raft, you'll find four large ballast bags. They have large openings around the top so that they flood quickly, along with weights in them which aid in sinking the bags into the water. Each bag will hold 16 gallons of water or 60 liters. This is going to create 650 pounds of ballast or 300 kilos. The life raft is equipped with a sea anchor with 100 feet of line or 30 meters, two paddles, a buoyant knife, and a rescue coit. The paddles are used to paddle yourself away should your vessel be on fire or if you are in a field of debris. The rescue coit is used if someone in your crew does not make it to the life raft. Rather than you getting out of the life raft, you would throw the rescue coit to them and pull them to the life raft. The sea anchor is equipped with 100 feet or 30 meters of line. You'll find your sea anchor on the top of the equipment pack. The sea anchor should be deployed once you are free of any debris or away from the boat should it be on fire. Viking does not automatically deploy their sea anchors, enabling you to paddle away from the boat as quickly as possible. There's a buoyant knife just to the right of the opening of the canopy to cut yourself away should your boat be on fire or sinking. If the boat is not on fire or sinking, stay tethered to the boat because the bigger you are, the easier you are to find. All rescue life rafts will be packed with an emergency equipment pack. Contents will depend on regulation or model. Emergency equipment packs are packed within every Viking life raft to meet relevant local regulations or requirements. Limited additional emergency equipment may be added to your life raft at purchase or packed in a Viking waterproof grab bag. The Viking Rescue Life Raft is available either in a soft valise or a hard fiberglass container. The most important thing you want to consider is where you will be able to stow it. It's most important that you are able to access your life raft within 60 seconds, and that's more for fire than sinking. Let's take a look at the options. Here we have the Viking Valise. It's in a water-resistant black nylon case. 
You can stow it either flat or you may stow it on its end. If you stow it on its end, always remember to keep the painter line up so that when removing it from the locker, you do not snag your painter line on the way out. We also have the ability for you to put your raft in a hard, low profile, high gloss container. If you choose this configuration, you have the option of either having your raft mounted on a rail, like you see it here, or you can have it mounted on the deck horizontally. If you choose to mount the raft horizontally, you can either release it manually, or you can have it released manually with the optional hydrostatic release, which will automatically deploy it should your boat sink and you are not able to get to it. When deploying your life rafts, you want to grab the red line coming out of the one end of the valise, tie it off to a strong point on board your boat, preferably a cleat. There's going to be 30 feet of line inside the bag or 10 meters. You want to pull until you get to the end of the line. This takes a while. When you get to the end of the line, you want to give it a swift tug. Once your life raft is deployed, pick up the same red line that you secured to the deck of the boat, pull the life raft over to you, jump into the life raft, try to stay dry, do not cut yourself away unless the boat is on fire or sinking. If it is, there's a knife right inside the opening that will allow you to do this. You've just seen the features of Viking's latest model, the Rescue Coastal. The Rescue Coastal is Viking's ISO 2 life raft and is geared towards rescue within 24 hours. The Viking Coastal has a three-year recommended service interval. For additional information, please contact us at vikingyachting.com. Thank you.